So an employee has just entered and submitted time and expenses, but you as a manager would like to approve them. To do so, we'll go to My Company, Pending Approvals. On the approval page, we see that we do not have workflow review set up. In order to set that up, we will select the link, add timesheet review to your workflow, and then we'll choose how we want to review. We can either choose by project team, which is based on the teams you have set up in your projects, and the team lead will act as the reviewer, or we can set it up by review by staff managers, which is based on the departments you can also set up in big time. For today, we'll choose review by staff managers. Now we see that we have 16.25 hours that you as a manager are able to review. If we click into the hours, we can see the individual breakdowns of each entry submitted. We can also click into the column under approved next to the period, and we can see each entry, click into the link, and we can actually edit the hours from here if need be. But for right now, we'll close, we'll go back to the timesheet, and we'll see our hours. In order to approve them, we'll select the Prove icon under the Action column, and now they're approved. For these hours, we would like to reject them. So we'll select the Reject icon, we'll enter in a note if need be, they're not mandatory, and then we'll select OK when finished. And now those hours have been sent back to the employee in order for them to edit and submit again. If we go back to the dashboard, now we see that there are no hours available for you to review at this time. But we'd also like to add expense review to our workflow. We'll select the Add Expense Review to your workflow, choose the option we'd like to review by, and we'll see one expense report that we'd like to review. So we'll click into the amount, we'll see the individual expense report, we can drill into the unapproved, choose the specific item, we can actually edit it from here if you would like. But for right now, we'll close, go back to our expenses, and we will approve this expense. Now if we go back to the dashboard, we'll see that we have no additional expenses to review, and that's review and approvals.